The approach I'm going to take is to start with the first equation and solve for x. So to solve for x, I need to start by getting the x term by itself. So I'm going to subtract the 3y over. Now I'm going to divide by 2, and thus x is solved for. Now I just need to take that and plug it into the second equation for x. Now y is the only variable in that equation, so I just need to solve for y. So I need to start by combining like terms, getting constants to one side, variables to the other. And after some algebra, I get y equal to negative one-fifth. Now I'm going to plug that back in and solve for x. And when I do that, I also get x equal to negative one-fifth. So the ordered pair solution is going to be negative one-fifth comma negative one-fifth, and the graph will be provided.